up y'all welcome back to my channel my name is mo if you didn't already know if you guys aren't already subscribed then make sure you go ahead and do that there is a bell right next to it if you didn't know you might as well hit that too so you don't miss out on any uploads of mine now today as you can tell by the title i am going to be doing a super huge pretty little thing try on haul you guys if you aren't familiar with them you need to get familiar like I am super obsessed every time I purchase something I'm always back on there and my cart gets back full again so before I get started I will leave all of the links in the description box also the sizes that I got and what I am normally in US sizes and UK sizing that way you guys can kind of you know get a little bit familiar on how it fits onto my body now shipping for me with pretty little thing is normally a week to a week and a half i'm not sure if it depends on how many things that i got or whatever the case may be is but it's actually not that bad you guys i have this really huge bag and it is completely full all of these things are based on like fall time so i kind of wanted to give you guys a few ideas now the picture that is on my thumbnail those are a few pictures that i have for my instagram wearing some of these items so if you guys are wanting to see how i do style them then make sure you are following me on instagram because i always post different pictures normally like three times a week just as I do on YouTube so I will leave all that in the description box and also probably somewhere on the screen so you guys can check it out but let's just go ahead and get into the video <music> see is these gray sweatpants and my last pretty little thing haul I did grab a pair but I felt like they were a little bit too big so I kind of wanted to size down I did also keep those as well just to kind of give me a different look but these are literally the same exact sweatpants I got them in a UK 4 and they just look like this I love the ruching around the waist and then it's also at the bottom so super cute basic sweatpants i will be wearing these all the time to kind of style in some outfits and also wear at home to be pretty chill so you can't go wrong with those and i got these charcoal black jeans i'm not sure if it's picking up that it is charcoal but the reason that i really got these because i have about like two or three pair of this type of color is because at the bottom it has like this really cute cut and I felt like that was different. You can kind of wear these over some boots, which would be like super, super cute. So I got these in a size UK 6. And I probably could have went down a size just so that they can fit a little bit more. But because it's fall time, you can kind of layer over some things so it wouldn't look like that bad. So that's how those look. Now I've been seeing this shirt literally all over Instagram. And I'm probably late and it may not be fall time you know worthy but I'm definitely gonna throw it in at least maybe for Christmas or something but I loved the colors on the pretty little thing I believe that they do have some sweatpants that go with this and I may order them next time but I got this in a size small and it's just this super cute oversized t-shirt they do have like a million of their shirts that say pretty little thing on them and I probably will get most of them but you guys super cute and you can definitely dress this up or keep it pretty chill as well the shirt that is in my thumbnail is actually this shirt and it has the ruffles around. I'm really loving this detail that they have going on with these one sleeve shirts. Like I'm so obsessed with them. I've been ordering them from every site that I do order from. Now my favorite on this is that it's a thong bodysuit. I hate bodysuits that do not have thongs. Like why do you even make them? Because you can see the print. But you guys this was really really cute and it was actually super comfortable and it was pretty thin so you know you can kind of get away with it now i got this in a uk you oh, UK. now i got this in a uk size six so it fit me pretty well and i'm glad i kind of sized up on this one because i was a little bit scared that it wasn't going to fit now, to pair with those i did grab these biker shorts you guys these are the most comfortable things that you can ever buy it doesn't matter where you get them from you have to have all colors and biker shorts i don't care what you say biker shorts are amazing and especially from pretty little thing like they have so many different colors and what i love about them is that they aren't see-through so you can wear these anywhere but i did pair these with that top so super super cute now you guys, I also seen this shirt trending, actually crop top trending, maybe last year. 
um, around this time and I did have to grab it. One thing I can say is that I probably should have sized up just a little bit more because it does show a lot of under boob but this may be just like a maybe a picture shirt. <laughs> If not, I'll probably go back and order the same shirt, just in a bigger size. But this would be really, really cute for the fall time. I love burnt orange. The bright orange is kind of like, eh, but the burnt orange is like, yeah, girl, you ready for fall? So this was really cute, and it is rib material, if you guys can see that. So super cute. And I believe I got this in a UK size 4, if I'm not mistaken. A UK size 8 so a US 4 which is probably a little bit not too small just like I said size up on this shirt if you do grab it now you guys I have been really obsessed with leggings that don't go all the way down to the ankle I don't know what you call those like 3 4 leggings or something like that but pretty little thing has a million of them so I went ahead and picked up a black and a white pair so this is the black pair and they don't go all the way down they're like past your knee just a little bit but with this I did pair it with this black crop top so you guys I made my own little set it didn't come together but I felt like it would be really cute to kind of have like a you know straight across cropped with some leggings and then you can throw on a super cute jacket and make it look bomb now you guys I tried to do it with the white but it didn't kind of turn out how I wanted it to but I still love both pieces so I got the white pair as well and with both of these leggings you cannot see through them at all it's like so freaking thick to where you guys can't see anything I even feel like with the white pair if you wear some colorful underwear then you are still okay now what I was trying to pair it with was this white top and as you guys can tell it's like two different whites but that's fine I'll still probably wear the top now one thing about it it does cut pretty low so I don't really have any boobs so it wouldn't matter for me but if you guys do this top you may want to grab like a little bit smaller just in case so I got this one in a size US or sorry UK 6 and then the leggings I also got in a UK 6 as well so these were really cute it just didn't work out as a set because I thought that they were the same color but it's okay but it's cute I did grab these brown leggings because in the fall time I love to throw in my browns and oranges browns and tans it kind of just makes everything pop if you guys get what I'm saying so I did just grab some simple brown leggings now these I feel like you'll probably be able to see through which I don't really care but I probably will most likely wear like a really oversized jacket or t-shirt to go with these and I did grab a UK size 6 as well but just some simple brown leggings nothing major you guys I've been wanting a pink blazer like for the longest so I finally found one on pretty little thing and you guys I am obsessed because I love pink so much and with this jacket, the only thing that I do not like is it doesn't have pockets that you can actually use. I don't know if I can cut a hole or something. Oh, I'm pretty sure I can cut a hole in it to make pockets. So, not a complaint anymore. But, you guys, this was really, really cute. And I believe I did grab it one size up just so it can be big. Nope, I actually grabbed a UK size 6. So, it does fit me pretty well, which you'll see on the try-on. But... I am obsessed with this pink jacket. You will see me wearing this literally like all seasons. I don't care if it's summertime. I'm going to sweat my butt off just to wear this little jacket. But really cute. The next thing that I got is this super oversized t-shirt dress. And it does say I am enough. Which I thought was so cute because I am. I'm enough. Just for me. So it is kind of like really really wide. So it will probably pair it with the belt that I'm actually about to show you guys. But it does fold on the sleeve a little bit. And then I got this in a size UK 8. Now you guys, this is really, really stretchy. So I don't think that it's going to shrink. So if you want to size down, you probably can get away with it. But I wanted it to fit like a really super oversized on me. So let me just show you the belt that I was thinking to pair with it when I do wear it. Really, really cute car seat belt looking thingy. And that is how it looks. So you guys, that would be really cute to pair with this t-shirt dress. Even if you didn't want to pair it with it, you can throw on like a really cute jacket or something for the fall time and it would look really, really long. 
also got these two items and it is this bodysuit t-shirt which I thought was really cute I probably would wait to wear this closer to the winter time just because of the color but I got this in a size UK 6 which I thought was really cute it is a little bit see-through but I feel like once you put on like a really nice little bra it won't be that bad and then I got these leggings which are so freaking comfortable you guys they are just this really cute green color. I'm kind of obsessed over this color a lot more than I am with this. But I will definitely be wearing these a lot. And I got them in a UK size 6. They are really fitted on me so I'd probably size up just a little bit. But I think I'll be fine for now until I gain some more weight. So this is how they look. And I love the little cut and detail in the leggings i thought that that was really really different i'm going to show you guys the accessories that i got from pretty little thing so the first thing that i got is this really cute small bag and i've been seeing them everywhere i wanted a solid color but i was kind of doing a theme on my instagram so i kind of figured i'd do this lime green one which i love the lime green so and it has the gold detail on it which is super cute now you guys, you can probably literally only fit like your cards. You probably wouldn't even be able to fit your money in it because this is my hand. And that's how small it is. But it's really cute to accessorize something and make something pop. It's like I could just throw this on right now and it'd be really, really cute. Now the last thing that I got is a pair of shoes. And you guys, I have been so obsessed with these shoes. Just look at these babies, y'all. I am, I'm living literally for these shoes. I'm so obsessed with them. If you guys are following me on Instagram, I did pair them. They'll actually be in my thumbnail as well. But they're so comfortable and cute. Like, you cannot go wrong with them. And I believe I got them in a size 6. I don't ever go size up or down on my shoes. But I do love these so much. One thing I can say is that you have to be a little bit careful when trying these on. Because you do not want to stretch out the lace part on it but yeah really really cute. all right you guys so that is all that i have for you from pretty little thing if you guys enjoy seeing videos like this then make sure you leave in the comments down below because i'm already shopping from them so if you want to see like what i'm getting then make sure you let me know you know i don't know if you don't tell me I'm always pairing these things together on my Instagram. I try to keep you guys updated on what's going on on my YouTube channel as well on my Instagram. So like I said, make sure you guys follow me on there to keep updated with me. Before I leave, I do just want to say thank you guys so much for 18k. I have been working so hard to get to where I wanted to be and I'm just so glad that you love watching my videos and you want to continue watching them. And I will continue to give you guys content as long as you guys are here. But just letting you guys know, when I do hit 50k subscribers, I know that may not sound like a lot, but it is, okay? I will be doing a super huge giveaway for two winners, so make sure you guys are pushing me up. As always, I will see you guys in my next video.